Delirious from head trauma, Pariah collapses in the clearing. In the dream into which Pariah then fell, she awakens on the ground in a state of complete quiet and peace. Next to her, the branches of a sprawling bay tree spread themselves out broadly against the moonlight. There is nothing threatening about the looks of the spreading tree or of the light breeze that gently rustled through its berry-laden branches. Rather, the sight of the tree and the sound of the wind rustling, it deepens the sense of serenity Pariah awakens into. Our Pariah is a waking dreamer, unable to discern reality from illusion. She opens herself up like a blooming flower, and in her newly unfolded openness, beholds for the first time that she is not alone. Standing beside her in her dream is another woman, older than Pariah, but shining with a glow of eternal youthfulness. The woman of the dream stands where a moment before the bay tree had been. The woman looks smilingly into Pariah's upraised eyes and speaks. Uncover the unseen. Imbalance. Delve deeper into the present. If only with our feeling of responsibility to guide us forward beyond. She gazes up at the apparition of Lori Green and sees it slowly vanish before her, leaving her all by herself in her dream. Let this desire be reason enough, and let it show us how to heal by example. How to move so 
She awakens from her dream to find herself in complete solitude.